All right, this is your boy Jug out with a new KVK strike for June 27th update. If this is your first time to my channel, please like, subscribe, drop a comment down in the comment section below, and hit that notification bell so you guys know when I come out with something next. All right, so as you can see here, I also have my line ID. You guys can add me online. I've got my own personal group. It's a general help group discussion. People having a bit of fun. Uh, there's pretty much only one rule. Don't be a bully. We've got new players, old players, and uh, a good group of really helpful people in there. All right, so let's get right on to what's going on with the strike. All right, so if you guys have seen my previous video, you'd probably notice that these were the kingdoms that were participating in the strike as of yesterday and it probably wasn't even updated at that time now let's flip over to today and even again this is probably still not completely updated all right this is going to be updated daily uh, as far as i've been informed as you can see you know this is more than tripled some of you may or may not be on social media so i'm going to flip on over to guns of glory's current response all right so a lot of you guys didn't come here to read so I'm gonna go ahead and read through a little bit of this here musketeers recently we have received lots of feedback and we want to start by saying thank you so much for your feedback and to help in guiding us towards our mission to improve our game below we have done our best to provide answers to the most questions we received. Event difficulties and event wars will be adjusted gradually from July. We are planning to make adjustments to events such as to make future improvements of better gameplay, rewards, and difficulty levels. These changes will be applied gradually to higher level threats on the Kingdom map, Red Guard camps, and Underworld gates. Also, starting from July, the rewards will be optimized, starting from major events such as UAC and Kingdom Raid. All right, so that you know that's a good plus. That's definitely what a lot of people were asking for. A lot of those rewards are extremely outdated. New events and gameplay. The brand new Alliance event, Tide of Darkness, will open to all kingdoms soon after testing first in the new kingdoms stay tuned kingdom migration we are aware of players in less active kingdoms having such request however we have to consider it's a complicated matter involves many other players i can understand how it's a, a little bit complicated but all it takes is a mod going in there talking to people getting that kingdom to communicate with the other people in the kingdom and give them a choice you know so I can't I know this has been and done in other games and it didn't work out well because it wasn't implemented correctly so hopefully when they do do it you know they put their thinking caps on in order to solve the problem we are planning to have more cross kingdom events and campaigns and carefully drafting a kingdom migration plan all right so I mean obviously there's no date set on that and you know when are they gonna implement it so that's definitely gonna be a big concern especially for the a lot of the old kingdom people airship exp calculation airship exp calculation the used airship exp was converted to both precision parts and scrolls while in the bag inventory the old airship exp were only converted to precision parts which is the reason why the numbers are different rest assured that we did the math carefully on this Thanks again for your feedback and support, and rest assured that we will do our best to make the game as smooth and rewarding as possible. Thank you, as always, for your help. You know, so it's definitely a step in the right direction. I know that my kingdom is still going to participate in the strike. Defend only, unless you're attacked. Um, and some of you may have seen this in your kingdom. I didn't see it in our kingdom chat, but they've also got the basic same things that they pretty much said there in that social media post one thing that i didn't see brought up and this was brought up to me by a few of my subscribers and it does seem to be 
quite a big concern to a lot of people. The 300% boost that you get after KVK. I remember doing it what, four, maybe six months ago, and I generally received most of my power loss back. And I can tell you that over the past few months, at least, I'd say three months, maybe two or three months, the power that I recover back after KVK, and that's using the entire 300% boost, is not nearly close to the 300%, quote unquote, that we used to get. So that's a huge concern here, as you can see here. Um, Gunmuse did mention something on one of his videos stating that uh, castle hits are no longer calculated in the 300% boost. You know, whether that's where they're taking it off you know, uh, it, it's anybody's guess, but you know, that's that's what he's got to say about it. There's one thing I'd like to add, if you are participating in the strike, there's a little bit of a trick that you guys can use to still take advantage of the 300% boost. All right, so normally you can recover whatever power loss that you got from KVK. All right, so what you can do is you can Talk to the other kingdoms that you are battling with. Have somebody do it, and you can port over there, and all you got to do is send maybe uh, 100 artillery or just send your artillery, and you can still take advantage of that 300% boost, all right? So what you can do is say you just send 100 artillery. I wouldn't just send one troop because I'm not really sure if that's going to calculate. So maybe send 100 of your highest tier artillery, at one of the enemy towers and then you go to create troops you hit that 20,000 uh, recruitment boost and then you get that 300% boost on those 20,000 troops I would suggest doing your highest tier troops of whatever it is that you personally need again guys feel free to drop by our group you can also search for us on Facebook. We've got uh, Guns of Glory unofficial group. We've got over 3,000 members, almost 3,500 now, and people are joining every single day. Again, a good group of really friendly people in there, very helpful, and a little bit of banter. All right, this is your boy Jug out with another KVK Strike update video. Peace.